What is going on, Ben Nation? Hope you're having a great morning. Happy April the Fool Day. Um, hope that's uh, something that you celebrate. Uh, yesterday, you had the big day. And I got to ask you the question. And you got to be honest with me. Did the Easter Benny bring you something? Did you get chocolate? Did you get candy? Did you get whatever you got? Was it good? Did you have ham? Whatever the case is. I hope you had a great Easter and I hope April the Fool's Day is good for you as well. Uh, we're going to talk price action. We're going to talk a little bit of news. Today marks the day for uh, Ben ATMs going. I still don't know whether to call them BTMs or ATMBs or BATMs. Ben against the machine. BATM. Look at that. All right, guys. We're having fun here. So anyway, um, we're going to check price action a little bit uh, in just a second. But... First of all, the big news of the day. Now, uh, waiting for staking, waiting for that announcement for the drop of staking. Of course, we said in the first quarter, uh, first quarter ended yesterday. So I assume either today, tomorrow, uh, we're going to see that staking mechanism kind of roll out here. Uh, but I don't have confirmation yet. So uh, if you'll grant me by tomorrow, I'll have it clarified for you. I do believe that we should have it any moment now. So, um, but let's kick it off with what's going on. So um, live stream. On Friday, uh, and we talked about this. So uh, the Ben Teller machines, Ben Teller, isn't that a guy that whatever? Uh, look at our chairman Ben Armstrong on the screensaver of the BTM machines. Ben taking on mass adoption. Be everywhere now. And listen, this is important. This is kind of an important thing, uh, and you may not realize it yet. But these BTM machines, these are the things. This, this is basically standing advertisement for uh, Bitcoin. Well, it's going to be a standing advertisement for Bencoin as well now, because Ben's going to be wrapped all over these things. And say what you will, uh, he's the most popular influencer in this crypto space. So uh, it is entirely possible that we see something magnificent uh, start to happen with the Bencoin price. And while we're talking about the Bencoin price, let's go check it out and let's see what it looks like right now. Remember, the market had quite a dip over the last 24 hours, uh, down about $70 billion, I want to say. Thanks, Ben. All right, guys, as you can see right now, we're kind of ranging in the volume uh, point of control. And that's kind of left us just kind of meandering inside this little range right here. Again, I keep telling you guys, I think we're going to get a little spike and a, and a push up into this range and come up here for a big test up here. Well, uh, we're still on track for it. We haven't broken out of this in any way. So uh, it, it it is kind of moving at the lower end of this right now. And that's a, a kind of a consolidation move that you're watching play out right now. That, that should indicate uh, a move towards the upside as that pressure uh, sort of builds. I do believe that we kind of you know reached our bottom, if you will, for uh, and we did that just a while back. So I think that and it's possible we can have a retest. Uh, I don't think so, but it, but it's possible we can have a retest. But uh, I think the news is starting to move in that direction uh, of positivity. So. A big move towards the upside looks like it's on tap. Money flow uh, seems to be in the positive. We got one announcement from Jerome Powell this week. I believe Bitcoin probably going to rip to about eighty thousand during this week. Maybe uh, you know there's, there seems to be this underlying sentiment of things kind of fomenting. This is the first part of the second quarter. Uh, this is going to be go time for a lot of investment profiles. So um, potentially something very very big happening. Uh, this week, and that should attract a little bit of attention into the Ben economy as well. So again, you're going to have to break out of this these two tests, these three test regions, if you will. And if so, then we are off to the races. Back to you, Ben. All right, guys, there you have it. Uh, this is what's on tap for the day. Uh, looks like uh, a lot of April fooling going on. Looks like Bitcoin probably getting a nice little pump or at least getting started on a nice little pump uh, over the next little while. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hit the like button, subscribe button, bell to be notified. And remember, this is not financial advice, but I'm always right.